Good morning, Mike. I'm going to shoot you a couple of videos of the houses that we haven't seen and send them to you. Uh, let you kind of get a preview of them. This is 22307 Cantera. It's in a cul-de-sac. Nice neighborhood. Looks like everybody takes good care of their lawns. It's surprising how big the yard is. We'll walk in. Come in the front. It opens up to the dining room, living room. Semi-open concept. Nice high ceilings in here. In the living room and to the left here is the office. It looks like they've had a little settling cracking up there. It's not bad. Doesn't look like water damage. It just looks like some kind of settling. <clears throat> Tell the homeowner has done some work in here, painting and such. Into the living room. It's good size. It's got built in bookshelves, gas fireplace. To the left here is the hallway that goes to the master. There's a half bath right here, or water closet. And then this, there's a linen closet, or coat closet actually, right here in this hallway. And then this goes into the master. Good sized master bedroom, views of the backyard, exit to the backyard. Let's get double box ceilings. Come into the bathroom. Double vanities, step in shower, tub, water closet, decent size closet, goes all the way over here. All right, we'll come back out of the master. <coughs> Back up into the living room. That hallway goes to the secondary bedrooms. We'll go in there in a second. Living room overlooks the pool. Nice natural light in here. I don't even have a light turned on in this room. It's pretty lit up. And then this area here opens to the kitchen. Kind of a breakfast nook here. And it is for mica countertops. They're not granite. Decent sized kitchen. And we'll go, let's go to the secondary bedrooms and upstairs and then we'll go outside. Come down this hallway, there's a linen closet here. Bedroom number two. Nine foot ceilings, it's nice. There's a closet. Here, a decent step in, decent sized step in closet. Come through bedroom number two to a Jack and Jill bath, double vanities, a linen closet here, toilet and shower here, and then bedroom number three is about the same size. Bedroom number two, <coughs> excuse me. Yeah, you can tell where the homeowner has done some painting. The camera shows everything. So, closet over here. A little bit bigger step in size closet. All right. Come out of these, out of this hallway, out of these two bedrooms. That goes back into the living room, kitchen. This goes out to the garage. Come in, here's the laundry room, the utility sink. And out to the garage. Or three steps coming in the house. Good size, two car garage, extra space. Water heater over there, a little storage area nook. All right, let's go upstairs real quick.
And this is bonus room. Decent size. This opens up to attic storage, HVAC access, a little bit of flooring up here. <clears throat> and this nook is to the side, could be used as a closet, turned into a closet. So this could be counted as a bedroom, fourth bedroom. There's a window, exit if needed to. Right, let's go out in the backyard. There again, a lot of natural light in the house, big windows. Back door, that goes to the master, covered patio. Three and a half steps coming into here. Really big, very well kept backyard. This patio down here, there is a ditch across the back or swale. I don't know how much water comes down through there, but. I mean, the backyard is huge. There's a playset and a little tree house over there. The swimming pool, of course. Fire pit out there. Pool looks to be in decent shape. Uh, the liner is older because it's completely faded, so it's probably time for a liner. The liner for this pool is probably five to seven grand, if I had to guess. This L-shaped pool, but this, it's a really nice pool. It's got a really big shallow end and then your deep end down there. The roof looks good. It's got some age on it that may be original to the home. We'd have to get an age on that, but really nice house. So as far as I can tell, just needs a little, little love and upkeep. A beautiful backyard. All right, I'm gonna shoot you a couple more videos over the course of the day and I'll send you a revised showing schedule. We had to move one of them to the end of the day. So, uh, but I'll make that change. You can decide if y'all want to go see it or not after you see the last one. So, uh, have any questions, give me a shout. Thanks.